Hi Matt fans and today we're just going to do a very quick video showing you about taking ArcGIS Pro offline. The reason that I'm showing you this now is because I'm in Honduras so apologies if the sound quality is a little poor. And why would you want to take Arc Pro offline? There's a number of reasons but here we are in ArcGIS online and if you go to your organization tab and click on that you'll see this little checkbox that allows you to disable offline usage of ArcGIS Pro. Now you might want to do that if you're managing lots of licenses for your organization, you can stop people taking Art Pro offline. But why would you want to take Art Pro offline and what are the benefits? One of the reasons you might want to take Pro offline is that the Pro license is actually linked intrinsically to your ArcGIS online license. So if you're in a place with no Wi-Fi or no internet connection and you try and open Art Pro, it's going to ask you to sign in. And without an internet connection, obviously you can't do that and you can't use Pro. Disaster. So let's have a look at this in Pro. I've got a project on the go and in order to get to our licensing, we need to hit Project. So click on that tab and instead of going to Options where you think it might be, it's actually in Licensing. Let's click on this tab. It might take a little while to pop up for some reason. And there it is. We can see our named user license, Esri extension. So this gives you all your license info. And down in the settings section, here we can use the checkbox to authorize ArcGIS Pro to work offline. Check that, and it'll tell you that you can now use it offline. It will ask if you want to sign in again, just so that you can access your portal uh, stuff. So if you've got data that you want to get off ArcGIS online, you can. And that'll bring up the old login screen. I'm just going to X out of that for the moment because what I would like to show you next is if we go back to our project, click on there, and over in the right hand corner, normally where you signed into ArcGIS Online, it'll tell you that you are not signed in. So you could sign in again if you're back to internet connectivity and you want to access some base maps or something, not a problem. But it does mean that you can now use Pro offline. And if you are heading to somewhere with limited or no internet connection, make sure that you set this up before you get there. Because if you find yourself without an internet connection, you won't be able to open Pro at all, and you won't be able to get to ArcGIS online. Ah! So that was just a really quick video on how to make ArcGIS Pro available offline. If you did like this video, please like, comment, subscribe, do all three, that'd be great. But I'll leave you now. Happy mapping, and I'll put up more videos when I'm back from Honduras.